You just drove along the Gulf Coast, but talk about uh, this dispersant as well. You wrote an article about uh, the effects it had on you personally. Right. About a week and a half ago, uh, my partner and I were down in Barataria talking with uh, shrimpers and fishermen and people affected by uh, the oil disaster. And j literally within minutes of driving down there, uh, the air was so uh, chemically laden, you could smell uh, and taste chemicals in the air, and immediately our eyes began to burn. And everyone that we were talking with there, Tracy Coons uh, with, with the Shrimpers Union, uh, Clint Guidry on the board of the Louisiana Shrimp Association, and their spouses and everyone else that we spoke with down there, everyone was complaining of different kinds of health problems. Uh, headaches, which actually, again, within minutes, I personally was starting to experience that shortness of breath, nausea, uh, all kinds of different symptoms, which I then went home and started to educate myself on uh, the immediate and then longer term effects of, of the two corexic dispersants being used and realized that myself and everyone that we spoke with down there were, were basically having uh, onset of these symptoms and uh, people are suffering from it very much and another very disturbing thing that I saw down there at, was uh, I met a uh, charter fisherman uh, named Gene Hickman who uh, showed me a video he had taken two days prior to my arrival there. He was outside of his house at night and he had a video of literally crabs crawling out of the water at night onto his bulkhead to escape the water. And Tracy Coons, who I was also speaking with, said, look, we've been watching regularly these huge plumes of dispersant under the surface of the water coming into our canals, sometimes bubbling up to the surface. Uh, we've seen uh, marine life fleeing from these. And there have been some reports of this happening throughout the Gulf, but then I went uh, down to Gene Hickman's house and then saw uh, just minutes after watching this video of crabs literally crawling out of the water trying to escape from the water to see uh, basically crabs floating belly up in the water, dead, all in his canal. There were sheen over the top of it, dead fish, and again, the stench of the chemicals was so intense that uh, our eyes were watering.